the wine world, you come across some terms or some words that make you go, huh, that's kind of fun. Let me roll that around for a bit and see how I can mangle it or how I can make it sound more fun. And I found one, Waluki Slope, Waluki Slope. It just sounds fun. Um, I may be saying it wrong. I'm sure it's got a different pronunciation even, but I like it and that's probably how I'm going to say it for the rest of my days. Today we're looking at the Seven Falls 2012 Merlot from Waluki Slope in Washington State. Now let's talk about the name Seven Falls Cellars inspired by Seven Falls that used to be part of the Columbia River. The brand is owned by Chateau Saint Michel and the Waluki Slopes are the hottest and driest in Washington State. So, what does that mean? It means that the grapes ripen early, er, and you can hang them longer to get more concentration. Now, yes, it's a five-year-old Merlot from Washington State. It is a 2012, but I bought it recently, so I'm assuming it might still be available. And so I thought, I, I, gotta, I gotta tell you about it. It's got mocha, plum, and some really supple tannins. It's rich, it's tasty, it's delicious. I know people aren't huge fans of Merlot these days, but I think this will bring you back into the fold. And um, you know what? I would still hold it for two or three more years. It's a delicious wine. It's the Seven Falls 2012 Merlot Waluki Slope. And I give it four stars out of five. I'm Michael Pincus, the Grape Guy for MichaelPincusWineReview.com. Join me again next week. We'll look at another great bottle of wine. You've been watching The Wine Review with the great guy Michael Pincus and generously sponsored by Zalto Glass Perfection. Don't miss a single video. Subscribe today by clicking the icon at the bottom right-hand corner of this video. To find out more about MichaelPincusWineReview.com, visit the website and while there, sign up for the bi-weekly newsletter to get all the latest views, reviews, video links, podcast updates, and so much more. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you next week.